Hello, this is Chaotix. This is just going to be a quick tutorial on how to set up Roblox on the Steam Deck. Do be aware that I'm not an expert on the Steam Deck slash Linux. Uh, there may be things I've missed or done wrong or ways to make the performance better. And if there are, please leave a comment about it. But first off, you want to go to power and switch to desktop mode. And say you want to go to the Discover Store and you want to search Grape Juice. If you want to know how to get the keyboard up, you just hold Steam and press X. There it is. Just click install. There we go. So once Grape Juice is installed, just close out of Discover. Go into Games. Down. And we should have Roblox here. You want to click on that to let Roblox install properly. And then Roblox is installed. And then, well, you just log in. Or log in with another device. And there we go. Um, excuse the time, um, it wasn't working for me earlier. That might have been because I was connected to the dock or something, I'm not sure. Either way, you can log in. I use quick login. Yeah. Uh, there is a few things you might want to do before joining a game, however. Uh, so what you want to do is close that and hop into the grape juice settings. The development. Go to player, scroll down, and you want to set your Roblox renderer to Vulkan. This should hopefully increase performance a little bit. And next up we want to add it to Steam so that we can access it through gaming mode and also change the controls. So open Steam, go to add a game, add a non-Steam game. And find your Roblox. Roblox app. Okay. Add selected programs. And then we can hop back into gaming mode for the rest. And as you can see, we have the Roblox app. My Steam Deck looks a little bit different because I use themes from Decky. The way. So yeah, uh, what you want to do is go on here. I have um, my current settings here. It is a modified version of default zeros controls. The only thing I've really changed is L5 pressing enter because sometimes the controller isn't detected properly and I have to press enter in certain games. There's a bunch of different community layouts for certain games including Phantom Forces, Jailbreak, ABA. Yeah, I personally use default zeros uh, controls. So the right touchpad is the mouse itself. The left touchpad is uh, scrolling up and down, and also to left click. When you launch Roblox through Steam, it might look a bit weird. There's an easy fix though. Simply join any Roblox game. In my case, I'm just going to hop into Friday Night Bloxin, open the menu, and turn on full screen. The game should look normal again. One thing that's um, to keep in mind, uh, as far as I'm aware, there's no way to access certain parts of the desktop app using this. For example, you can't access the private servers, badges, game passes and gear, etc. Doing so will just kind of break things. There's something supposed to be here, but you can't see it. Close it, and then it breaks the controls. Yeah, that's something to keep in mind. Um, if you do want to like hop into a private server, you can just like have an alt, friend the alt, and then have that alt go into that private server. But yeah, uh, that's pretty much it. So, um, thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, give it a like and a comment. I won't ask you to subscribe since I'm mostly just a Roblox YouTuber. I don't know half the thing the Steam Deck can actually do. I just wanted to make this video in case anyone else wants to try this after my latest video. So, again, thanks for watching. Ciao for now.